we're going to talk a little bit about uh, a protein, a gene called HER2 and, and its relevance in lung cancer. HER2 is actually really important in oncology, especially in non-lung cancer oncology. So in breast cancer, for example, HER2 has be, been a really important biomarker that helps guide the way we treat it. HER2 is part of a family of genes that basically acts as the on switch. So every one of our cells has HER2 present in it, and HER2 basically tells our cells when to divide. And HER2 can be abnormal in two ways. It can be either overproduced or amplified. So you have just too much of the HER2, and that's sending too much of a signal telling the cells to grow, which can lead to cancer. That's the problem we see in things like breast cancer. But the other abnormality that can occur is a mutation, so a genetic alteration within the HER2 gene itself that then produces that protein. And when it's mutated, it can be sort of stuck on. So it's basically constantly telling the cells to grow and that can lead to cancer. In lung cancer, HER2 mutations seem to be the most important problem. And they're fairly uncommon. About two to 3% of lung cancers have HER2 mutations, but they become more important to us because we do have some treatments now specifically for HER2 mutated lung cancer.